Last Wednesday, there was a video release by James O'Keefe. And the video in which O'Keefe Media Group, you can find it on YouTube, he's kind of famous for doing these ambush videos. And he starts off the video with uh, a statement, the FEC data shows that some senior citizens across the U.S. have been donating thousands of times per year. Some of these individuals' names, addresses are attached to over $200,000 in campaign contributions. I'll certainly defer to the committee on the substance of the bill and the amendment, but I would just ask that we not create conspiracy theories on the House floor in real time. It would just be good if we kept to the facts of our amendments and our bills and not conjure up conspiracy theories in real time. I think we have enough of that when we uh, scroll on our phones. It's not a conspiracy theory. There is just more than a coincidence. This amendment simply has the state prosecutor offering a study of the past four years for contribution irregularities, investigating excessive contributions made to the state and federal campaign finances in this state, identifies contributions made under incorrect or unverified names, and documents those reports of contributions and irregularities, and then a report to be due to the General Assembly by next year. It's a pretty simple amendment. There is obviously likely a problem, and, and look, for us to look into it, I mean, that's our duty. That's our job. I would encourage everyone on this floor to take a look at this report. It's a video report, um, and James O'Keefe visited a number, uh, quite a few houses in Annapolis. He was here in Maryland. So this is a real problem, and uh, we will certainly follow up with a letter to the state prosecutor and the Board of Elections, but uh, this would be a chance for us to speak as a body. Thank you.